gonna f there is another thing you could do for me suitable for someone of your come let's go find Farengar, my court wizard he's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and rumors of dragons Varengar, I think I found someone who can help you with your dragon project. Go ahead and fill her in with all the details. So the Earl thinks you can be of use to me. Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragon. Yes, I could use someone to fetch... Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. Ah, no mere brute mercenary, but... You see, when the stories of dragons began to circulate, many dism... One sure mark of a fool is to dismiss anything that falls outside his experience as being impossible. But I began to search for information about dragons. Where had they gone all those years ago? And where were they coming from? I, uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Falls Barrow. A dragon stone said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. Ah, the dragon stone of Bleak Falls Barrow. You already found it. You are cut from a different cloth than the usual brutes the Jarl foists on me. That is where your job ends and mine begins. The work of the mind. Sad. Wait for me. Farangar. I wonder what Irileth is so excited about. Farangar, you need to come at once. A dragon's been sighted nearby. You should come too. A dragon? How exciting. Where was it seen? W what was it doing? I'd take this a bit more seriously if I were you. If a dragon decides to attack Whiterun, I don't know if we can stop it. Let's go. You look tired, friend. The Bannered Mare has beds for rest. So, Irileth tells me you came from the Western Watchtower? Yes, my lord. Tell him what you told me. dragon. No, oh, that's right. We saw it coming from the south. It was fast. faster than anything I've ever seen. What did it do? Is it attacking the watchtower? No, my lord. One of the new servants? Remember that I like my meat rare. Father says I'm too young to train with the sword. So I Good work, son. We'll take it from here. Head down to the barracks for some food and rest. You've earned it. Irileth, you'd better gather some guardsmen and get down there. I've already ordered my men to muster near the main gate. Good. Don't fail me. There's no time to stand on ceremony, my friend. I want you to go with Irileth. You survived Helgen, so you ha But I haven't forgotten the service you did for me in re- As a token of my esteem, I have instructed Avenici that you are now- And please, accept this gift from my personal armory. I should come along. I would very much like to see this dragon. No. I can't afford to risk both of you. I need you here working on ways to defend the city against these dragons. As you command. One last thing, Irileth. This isn't a death or glory mission. Oh. I need to know what we're dealing with. Don't worry, my lord. 
I'm the very soul of caution. I know your family's honor is important to you, but we can't afford it. It took me weeks to find out. Ripe fruit and fresh vegetables for sale. Straight from the fields and orchards of White Run. Do you get to the Cloud District very often? Patron of the Great Clan, Zappelmo. Here's the situation. Be careful. A dragon. Got some good pieces out here if you're looking to protect yourself or deal some damage. Don't forget to check inside the shop if you need anything. I said a dragon. I don't much care where it came from. Oh, it took years. But I earned my way to the top. I own Chilfero Farm, you see. Very successful business. That's a fair question. None of us have ever seen a dragon before, or expected to face one in battle. But we are honor-bound to fight it, even if we fail. This dragon. 
dragon is threatening our homes, our families. Could you call yourselves Nords if you ran from this monster? Are you going to let me face this thing alone? No, We're no, so I'll dead. But it's more than our honor at stake here. Think of it. The first dragon I work with my mother. So first vegetables. It's fun most days. Hard work. Killing it is ours. If you're with me. Now what do you say? Shall we go kill us a dragon? Yeah, damn yeah. right. Let's move out. No signs of any dragon right now, but it sure looks like he's been here. I know it looks bad, but we've got to figure out what happened, and if that dragon is still skulking around somewhere. Spread out, and look for survivors. We need to know what to Here somewhere. Rocky and Tor just got grabbed when they tried to make a run for it. We'd better find out what's happened. Kid, let's save us. Here he comes again.
come to chat with an old Gods and Dragon Reach. The future of Cyrus! The future of Cyrus! <sighs> I envy you. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostilities, like the rest of... I believe I am, yes. Technically speaking, of course. Ah, that reminds me. Speaking of alchemists, I have... Would you be so kind as to deliver the frost salts for me? Good. You're clearly better suited than I... A prospective student, are you? Well, I'm afraid I'm not much good at teaching. You should try your luck at the College of Winterhold. If I said that was a tedious question, would you be smart enough to know what I meant? Probably not. As long as I'm left alone to pursue my research, I don't... Now, I'm a busy man, and your pointless questions are boring me terribly. Good day. I envy you. Hmm. I had you figured for a mage. I think you'll appreciate this. You know, if you've got the aptitude, you should join the Mages College in Winterhold. All this standing around is rubbish. We should be taking the fight to the Stormcloaks.
Turn around and go back the way you came. We're causing no trouble. All we ask is to look for her. I don't care what you're doing. After what happened, you're lucky I don't toss you in jail. Now get lost. We will be back. This is not over. You there. We're looking for someone in White Run. We'll pay good money. A woman. A foreigner in these lands. She is likely not using her true name. We are not welcome here in White Run. So we will be in Rorikston if you learn anything. It's none of your concern. All you if that doesn't interest you, feel free to walk away. If you locate her, find us in Rorikstead. You have you. You have news of our quarry. Tor just got grabbed when they tried to make a run for it. Oh! <laughs> 
dragon right now, but it sure looks like he's been here. I know it looks bad, but we've got to figure out what happened. If that dragon is still so let's put the video back on. Spread out. So I turned the game on to legendary. Yeah, legendary. Um, because before we were playing as uh, adept, and legendary is kind of harder, a little. Hmm. No, be back. It's still here somewhere. It's still okay, here somewhere. Not cool. <laughs> okay, it was kind of cool. <laughs> what was <it> mean? <laughs>
signs of any dragon right now. It sure looks like he's been here. I know it looks bad. We've got to figure out what happened. Hmm, let's go. No, get back. It's still here somewhere. Rocky and Tor just got grabbed when they tried to make a run for it. really hard. Really hard. Still here from there. Good boy. 
close. like I'm hitting something. Everybody, you'll be there. Whoa. Oh, nobody. What happened to you? What you eat to him? Oh no. Rest in peace. What is happening? Oh no. Dragons in Skyrim. 
The Dragonborn would slip. That's what you did, isn't it? Absorb the dragon's power. Well, you can shout now. You couldn't before, right? That can only mean one thing. You must be Dragonborn. That's right. My grandfather used to tell stories about the Dragonborn. Those born with the dragon blood. Like old Tiber Septim said. I've never heard of Tiber Septim killing any dragons. <laughs> there weren't any dragons there, idiot. They are just coming back now for the first time in forever. But the old tales tell of a dragonborn who could kill dragons and steal their power. You must. Exciting, isn't it? Well, anyway, we can turn off the camera. It is not so interesting for me to do anyway. Say you're left. You're being awfully quiet. Come on, here, left. Tell us, do you believe in this dragonborn business? <laughs> Some of you would be better off keeping quiet than flapping your gums on matters you don't know anything about. Here's a dead dragon, and that's something I definitely understand. Now we know we can kill them, but I don't need some mythical dragonborn. Someone who can put down a dragon is more than enough for me. You wouldn't understand, Housecar. You ain't an orc. I've been all across Tamriel. I've seen plenty of things just as outlandish as this. I'd advise you all to trust in the strength of your sword arm over tales and legends. That was shouting what you just did. Must be. You really are Dragonborn. That was the hairiest fight I've ever been in, and I've been in more than a few. I don't know about this dragonborn business, but I'm sure glad you're with us. You better get back to White Run right away. Jarl Bagra will want to know what happened here.
This war is as stupid as a few of Clan Grey Main. I ain't much for talking. Why? Skyforge Steel is my art and honor. The companions need the best, so they come to me. I don't think so. I don't think so. There's been talk amongst the guards. Dragon. Finally, I serve Jarl Balgruff as steward. From Adrian? Ah, this must be that weapon for the Jarl. Poor girl. So eager to prove us. Thank you. Please, take these few coins for services rendered. That is an old tale. Long ago, there lived a mighty hero of the Nords. Olaf One-Eye. Olaf did battle with a fearsome dragon named Numenex. The struggle between Olaf and the dragon culminated in a mighty duel atop Mount Anthor, with Olaf the victor. Olaf returned in triumph to Whiterun. By his decree, the city's keep was rebuilt as a prison, and so, from that time until this, our great keep has been called Dragon's Reach. Well... There are three of them. The Plains District is so named because it's the closest of the three to the plains that surround the... Most of the city's residents live in the Wind District. Dragon's Reach occupies the highest, which we call the Cloud District. From here, the Jarl can see all that goes on within his city. The Jarl has put out a bounty on some bandits. Here, take a look at this decree for details. Splendid! There's a house available right now. Very well. Just let me know when you have the necessary funds. Enjoy your visit to Dragon's Reach. What else could it mean? The Greybeard. We were just talking about you. My brother needs a word with you. So what happened at the Watchtower? Was the dragon there? I knew I could count on Irileth. But there must be more to it than that. So it's true. The gray beards really were some masters of the way of the voice. They live in seclusion high on the slopes of the throat of the world. The dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the voice. The ability to focus your vital essence into a doom. Or if you really are Dragonborn, Didn't you hear the they thundering can teach sound you as you return to Whiterun? That was the voice of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Rothgar. This hasn't happened in centuries, at least. Not since Tybiseptim himself was summoned when he was still Talos of Atmora. Rangar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Capable as she may be, I don't see any signs of her being this, what, dragonborn. 
No nonsense. Why, you puffed up ignorant. These are our sacred traditions that go back to the founding of the First Empire. Prongar, don't be so hard on Avenuchi. I meant no disrespect, of course. It's just that, what do these Greybeards want with her? That's the Greybeards' business, not ours. Whatever happened when you killed that dragon, it revealed something in you, and the Greybeards heard it. If they think you're Dragonborn, who are we to argue? You'd better get up to High Hrothgar immediately. There is no refusing the summons of the Greybeards. It's a tremendous honor. I envy you, you know, to climb the 7,000 steps again. I made the pilgrimage once. Did you know that? High Hrothgar is a very peaceful place. Very disconnected from the troubles of this world. I wonder that the Greybeards even notice what's going on down here. They haven't seemed to care before. <sighs> no matter. Go to High Hrothgar. Learn what the Greybeards can teach you. You've done a great service for me and my city, Dragonborn. By my right as Jarl, I name you Thane of Whiterun. It's the greatest honor that's within my power to grant. I assign you Lydia as a personal housecarl, and this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge of office. I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Wouldn't want them to think you're part of the common rabble, now would we? We are honored to have you as Thane of our city, Dragonborn. Back to business, Proventus. We still have a city to defend. Yes, my lord. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Now, if you don't mind, I've got a city to keep. The Jarl has appointed me to be your house, Carl. It's an honor to serve you. As my Thane, I'm sworn to your service. I'll guard you and all you own with my life. The Jarl has recognized you as a person of great... The title of Thane is an honor, a gift for your service. Guards will know to look the other way if you tell them who you are. Lead the way. <laughs> Starved cloaks, Imperials, dragons. Ain't no matter to me. Was trouble in White Run, and I'll pull you into the Dragon's Reach dungeon. Come on in. We got warm food, warm drinks, and warm beds. I enjoy this work well enough, but I'm ready to retire. I've been thinking of selling the inn to Isolda. Anyway, what do you need? I assume you saw the Gildergreen? Big tree, all burnt up. It's part of the Temple of Kinareth. 
People want Tanika to do something about it, but I don't know what they expect. <sighs> I should have guessed as much. Your kind sticks... You'd never think to learn from a Nord like the Jarl's wizard. Sure thing, it's yours for a day. I'll show you to your room, right this way. The security in Whiterun is terrible. Shameful is what it is. Think you can go blade to blade with me? You'd be dead in six seconds. Let me know if there's anything else you need. The heat of the battle is the fire that forges the strongest blade. That and a true Nord never misses a chance to tell. You've been talking to those companions. Too hot-headed, they cried. Weak, pathetic cowards, the lot of them. It wasn't my fault. I told them. They wanted me to there prove my worth. So Ragnarok they threw me up against a young whelp of a lad, hardly old enough to grow his first chin hairs. I guess they thought a woman wasn't strong enough to hurt him. I didn't mean for him to die. Why would I want that? I just... I just lost control. But then he went quiet, did Ragnar Red, when he met the shield maiden Matilda, who said... Oh, what are you, you talking about? Fool, I you drink a lot of mead. Now I think it's high time that you lie down and bleed. And so then came clashing and slashing of steel, as the brave lass Matilda charged in full of zeal. And the braggart named Ragnar was boastful no more. When his ugly red head rolled around on the floor. Fair coin for a poor old beggar. The security in White Run is terrible. Shameful is what it is. being a woman in Skyrim, I know. But stay strong, and men will come to respect you. And I miss the days when the Grey Manes and Battleborns Never got along. You. Ever since the war started, we've been at each other's throats. That's what I thought. Take a good look around. I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. If not, let me know. I might have it stored away. You look rather pale. Could be a taxia. It's quite a problem back home in Cyrodiil. Splendid, splendid. It's for a special brew I'm working on. A love elixir like none other. Maybe I'll test it on Faringar first. Oh, but I suppose you expect some compensation. Um, here. These potions should suffice. Of a sort. I don't have formal training in the restoration school. Within these walls, I have all that I need to brew. If I had a septum for every case of rock joint or whitbane I've cured since I opened this shop, I'd be a rich woman indeed. Why? Because I'm a proud citizen of the Empire? Because the Stormcloaks only want Nords in Skyrim? The Stormcloaks can rot in oblivion for all I care. I've lived in this city for 20 years. 20! As long as you clean up. You know how to use it, right? Makes a couple of... A little wheat and blister wart makes a healing potion, if you didn't know. We have plenty of ingredients for sale, too. I think I can teach you a thing or two.
remedies for ailments both common and rare. Do let me know if I can be of service. Interesting mixture. Keep it experimenting. You'll improve with practice. Nothing of our struggles, our suffering. Nothing? And what of my son, hmm? What of Thorold? Is he nothing? So don't talk to me about suffering. Your son chose his side, and he chose poorly. And now he's gone. Such is the way of war. The sooner you accept his loss, the better. I will never accept his death. My son still lives. I feel it in my heart. So tell me, Battleborns, where is he? Where are you holding my four out? <laughs> Do you believe this old hag? Holding him? What are you looking at? Why, I'm not I've afraid got of him you. in my no. cellar. Even if you are He's my, my prisoner. Face it, Cal. Your stupid son is dead. He died a storm cloaked traitor. And you, you best keep your mouth shut before you suffer the same. Come on, Father. There's nothing more to be said here. I'm here to buy food, Museum. I suppose you don't need to worry about that. Owning a farm has advantages. Ripe fruit and fresh vegetables for sale. Hello, Friday. Chops and steaks fit yeah. for y'all. Yeah. Come and see my special. Just browsing. Or were you looking for something particular? I work for Bellathor at the General Goods Store. You're someone who can get things done. Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs.
Don't forget to check inside the shop if you need anything. Trouble? Need something? Unlike the rest of my family. I've got work to do. Keep your important deliveries to make. No time for chatting. Important deliveries to make. No time for chatting.
running so I can get out of the back. That's the best you can do.
I've got your back. I am at your command. I am at your command. Right behind you. How can I serve you, my Thane?
Let's get going then. Still here. How can I serve you, my Thane?
something? Get myself. Right behind you. I am sworn to carry your burdens. on. Someone there. 